Yeah, this is uh, Cool Me 133 bringing you another review. Uh, today I'm reviewing uh, Boondocks. Boondocks, I reviewed Boondocks before. This particular show, you know, uh, you know I get a review, you know. Uh, this is Boondocks, uh, the return of Stink Meter. Uh, Stink Meter is, the, is this old guy at Boondocks. Well, anyway, what happened was um, Granddad had killed Stink Meter and sent him to hell. And uh, the devil sent Stink Meter back uh, in, the, uh, in the body of Tom Dubois. Tom Dubois is a lawyer on... Uh, He's like, uh, Tom DeGuire is like this, uh, this black dude. He's a black dude, but he's like a lawyer, and he's really white, and he's married to a white woman. But, no, he's not really white, he's really black. But he's married to a white woman, well, anyway, Tom du uh, Stink Me to Possesses him. The first thing, first thing Stink Me to do is uh, get time into a fight with this black dude over a parking spot. Oh, and then, and then he goes, that night he goes to Tom DeGuire's house and has sex with Sarah, Tom DeGuire's uh, um, wife. And uh, what happened is uh, later Tom DeGuire buzzes into the bathroom and tries to kill um, Granddad with a with a hatchet, and then Huey and, and Rally comes in comes in the picture, and they try to save Granddad. All three of them is karate fighting and whatnot. And they throw Dan Grant the belt, and you know it's a pretty good karate fight. But anyway, in the end, Granddad gets um. Get stick me to around around the ankle and whatnot, and they get him to the bed. They tie him to a bed, and then uh, they tie him to a bed, and what you call him? Uh, they they call they call uh, Uncle Uncle Ruckus, and Uncle Ruckus is now Reverend Ruckus and shit, cause he got a whole lot of different jobs he do. I guess he's a he he gets rid of possessed people first. Anyway. They try to get the devil out of Tom Tugwa. I mean, not the devil. They try to get, uh, what they, try to, they try to get, uh, stick me to out of Tom Tugwa. And they start, and they, and they start beating him. They, what you call him is in this two ghost face killer. Ghost face killer comes to, uh, Huey and, and telling Huey, Huey that the only way he could get him you know how to get that ghost out here in peace. And then he finally figures out that he's saying peace. Peace gets the ghost out. Anyway, while while he's upstairs, Granddad is also on this, like, uh, this dating thing and whatnot. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The, uh, the, um, he's, like, uh, on computer dating. He's computer dating and whatnot, and the computer date girl comes over and whatnot. And um, he's and he's talking to the girl, trying to rap to her. He answered the door with nothing but his drawers on and whatnot. And they got homeboy tied up upstairs, and he's trying to date this girl. And this girl tells him, yo, I don't mind, I don't mind, you don't have to lie, because the dude's up there yelling and while he tied up, how he going to do I'm gonna kill uh, Granddad and whatnot. And the girl walked out. Cause the girl said, "Yo, you should you should lie about you having a guy possessed by an evil spirit up there." Anyway, anyway, you know, they gets into it and whatnot. The Ghostface Killer helps him, and uh, well. In the, in, the, in the end, you know, uh, they win and shit, and like, 
they, 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 Uncle Ruckus and whatnot agrees with uh with with Stink Meter about the hate niggas and whatnot, and they come to a peace, and that peace gets uh the evil spirit out of uh, Tom Duqua. Anyway. I was about the boondocks, you know, this wasn't a particular this wasn't a particular good show. It was alright. I like the karate part. I like him when he go on a date. I didn't like the part where where uh he was in his underwear and they had that little kid taking pictures, he had his grandson taking pictures of him. I thought that was kind of crazy, but you know what? I know people who do that. I know a person, I know people who've done that, so, you know. But anyway, it was a good show. Bull Doctor's always good. You know, um, Huey always good. The karate scene was good. Tom DeGuire kicking that black dude uh, but kicking that black dude ass and whatnot for taking the spark of Scott was good, is it? Come on, nigga. I knew somebody used to say that all the time. Hey, nigga. Anyway. Blue Doctor's always good. This is Cool Me 133. And giving you another review for free. <laughs>